Want to know all the details about Norwegian's go-kart track at sea? We've got all of that coming up. If you're about to set sail on Norwegian Bliss or Norwegian Joy, I wanted to share some of the details of what you can expect on these go-kart speedways at sea. It's Tanner here from Cruisely.com, and we recently sailed on the Norwegian Joy and got to try the speedway firsthand. Now we realize there's a lot of questions about the details of the experience, and we wanted to tell you everything you need to know. First up, the go-karts are only available on two of NCL's newest ships, the Bliss and the Joy. Now given the popularity of the racetrack, we expect to see them on future ships, but as of now, it's only those two. So if you aren't setting sail on the Bliss or the Joy, sorry, you're out of luck. So how does racing actually work? Well, first, it starts with something kind of boring, reservations. You definitely want to make reservations the moment you get on the ship if you know that you want to race during your cruise. It's a really popular activity and slots fill up fast. Now, given that only about 10 people can race at any time, you need to reserve early to ensure your spot. What's really convenient is that you can reserve your spot right from your stateroom TV. Okay, so let's talk about costs. Each ride costs $15 per person, and that price has risen sharply in recent months. We've seen reports that the track was only about $7 a year ago. The good news is the higher price should help to limit some of the crowds. Now, when you're ready to ride, you can select either a single person cart or there are also double carts available for those who want to ride in tandem. One of the great things is that there's no minimum age to drive. You don't have to have a license or be 16 years old or anything like that, but there is a minimum height. You have to be at least 55 inches, which is a little bit above four and a half feet tall. So when you head to the speedway, you wanna be sure that you're dressed for the part. They won't let you drive in flip flops. It's closed toe shoes only. Also be sure you aren't wearing anything loose. Uh, for instance, a scarf. Anything that can get caught up in the wheels and dragged is a really bad idea and they won't let you race with it. Helmets are provided for you and you also get a helmet sock that fits over your head and underneath the helmet. Okay, so what everyone really wants to know is how fast did the carts go? On our cruise, a good lap time was about 30 seconds. That means you aren't going really fast given the length of the track, but with all the twists and turns, it really does feel like you're flying. In fact, if you don't let off the gas in some corners, you're gonna take in too much speed and run the risk of spinning out. Speaking of the speed of the carts, one thing that's probably gonna throw you off at first is the speed control. So since the carts are electric, the staff on the ship can control the power. So when you first start and you're coming out of the pits, you're going extremely slow, not even a walking pace. But once everybody is out on the track and ready to race, they turn up the juice and you can start flying around the track. So we loved racing the go-karts on the Norwegian Joy, but if there is one complaint about the racetrack, it's that you can get stuck behind a slow driver and given the turns and the width of the track, finding a spot to pass can actually be kind of tough. So if someone's going slow around the track, you could be going at a turtle's pace behind them until things open up for passing. Okay, the bottom line, should you spring the money to try the track during your cruise? During our trip, We'll be honest, it was the most fun thing we did on the entire cruise. We'd say it's absolutely worth trying once, but totally understand if the price is too much to continue to go again and again and again, because it really does add up. Well, that's it about the Speedway. If you have more questions about the go-kart track on Norwegian ships, let us know in the comments below. Also, be sure to subscribe for more videos and visit us at cruisely.com. 